Jasmine Marino is one of the many survivors of human trafficking. How old were you when you were when you got into the life? I was 19. Yeah. And I wasn't addicted to drugs, anything like that. But by the time I exited around 27, I had a full-blown heroin addiction, completely homeless. Jasmine was initially introduced to prostitution by a man she thought loved her. I thought that I willingly chose it. I didn't see the manipulation and all that. Human trafficking is defined by the U.S. Department of Defense as a crime in which force, fraud, or coercion is used to compel a person to perform labor, services, or commercial sex. The FBI says 90% of their human trafficking cases involve prostitution. The biggest misconception? That victims typically come from outside of the U.S. You could have a young girl who doesn't come from a home that has a lot of money and she sees kids at school with new clothes that they get their nails done and so somebody a predator a trafficker can pick up on that and say oh I can buy you some new clothes do you want to get your nails done and they think that this person is their friend or becomes their boyfriend and then that's when the sex trafficking starts the FBI now takes a victim centered approach but prosecuting their traffickers isn't that easy cases that are very difficult without victim cooperation and some of these victims don't see themselves as victims to begin with. That was the case with Jasmine until she sought help. No little girl dreams of becoming a prostitute when they get older. She got clean and she's an advocate for other trafficking victims and a symbol that help is out there. Anya Tucker, News 10 ABC.